Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 10 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about so all wishlisted products. So let's see how can we so all wishlisted products. So first of all, go to the wishlist controller. So here inside this controller, uh, let's create a new function. So right here, public function and function name. Uh, let's say function name is a get this listed products okay and inside this function just write here dollar items is equal to card colon colon instance and set the instance this list and call here the contained method Contained. Okay, and now just return this items to the view. So return return view and add here the view name. Uh, let's say view name is this list and then pass here big bracket and just pass here the items items arrow dollar items okay now save this file now let's create uh, this view so go to the resources directory views and uh, here let's create a new file this list dot blade dot php okay now add here the extend the layout so right here dollar extends and layout name which is first add the directory name layouts and layout name which is base and now add the section section name which is contained and now close the section so right here in section okay and now let's create the route for this uh, function so go to the web.php file and here let's create a new route so right here route colon colon get add the uri this list and then controller name which is this list controller colon colon class and function name which is this one and now add the route name which is this list dot list now save this file and uh, now go to the this list or php file and here let's copy the content for the template directory so go to the template folder and from here let's open this one wishlist.html in visual studio code so right click open with vs code and from this template file let's copy the uh, let's copy this section so just select this and this one also just select two section and copy and paste inside this wishlist.php file okay inside this section just paste here now save this file now here let's add the home page link so just remove this and add here the route app dot index Okay, and uh, inside this table, uh, first of all, uh, before this, before this row, let's add here. If uh, dollar uh, at the rate if dollar items arrow count is greater than zero, then 
display this row otherwise just add here the else part and inside this else part after this just close the indif and inside this else part let's add here the div class is equal to row and just close this div and then add the column here dot cool md12 and add one more class text center and inside this uh, div let's add here the message inside the s2 tag your wish list is empty and one more and one more line inside the h5 tag also set the class margin top mp3 and add the text and items to it now and close this h5 tag okay now add here the soft page link so anchor tag href route and route name soft.index add the class here btn btn warning and set the margin 5 okay empty that's 5 and text here soft now move this anchor tag okay now let's display the this listed item inside this table so before this tr let's add here add the rate for h this one dollar items edge dollar item and now just cut this in for each and paste after this closing PR tag okay now let's display here the product name so select this and right here dollar item arrow model arrow name and let's copy this and paste here for, for the price so right here a regular underscore price also display here the regular price so let's copy and paste here and for the image let's select this double curly bracket asset add here the URI and just remove this and here add the forward slash double curly bracket dollar item arrow model arrow image okay now let's display here the stock status so inside the study just add here the if directive if dollar item arrow model arrow stock status stock status is equal to in stock then display the in stock here and add the else part just add here the p tag 
and uh, uh, display the text is talk out okay and now close this effective so right here end if and now add here the link for the product so let's copy the link from the cart so here from here just copy this one and inside the wishlist.php file just select details.php and press ctrl plus v to select it now paste here this one okay now save this file now it's done one more thing now let's add here the link for the wish list on this icon so go to the layout file so let's open the base.play.php file and here let's add the link so right here double curly bracket route and route name which is this one this list dot list so copy and paste here now save this file now everything is done so let's check this so switch to the browser and just refresh the page now let's check the wish list item so just click on this icon and here you can see the wish listed item okay these are the seven items now let's add one more so go to the shop page and go to the next page and uh, let's add this one to the wish list so just click on this icon add it and you can see here eight item now just click on this icon and here is the eight items in wish list okay so in this way you can show all wish listed products so that's all about show all wish listed products don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching